Hey guys, it's Nikki Jabor for Johnny's Selected Seeds, and today I'm growing butterhead lettuce. I'm going to plant some seeds for Adriana, a wonderful variety with deep green leaves. It's heat tolerant and disease resistant. So you know what? It's time to plant. There are two main ways to start lettuce. You can sow the seeds indoors to get a head start on the planting season, or you can direct seed in garden beds. And lettuce can be either direct seeded or transplanted outdoors once the soil temperatures are 45 to 50 degrees Fahrenheit or 8 to 10 degrees Celsius. I generally direct sow when I want baby greens and I transplant when I want full sized heads. So to direct sow, I plant the seed in about a four inch wide band, scattering the seed evenly and trying to space it about an inch apart. And then I'll cover it with about an eighth of an inch of soil. If I want my direct sown lettuce to form full sized heads, I'll eventually thin them to 8 to 10 inches apart. And if I'm going to transplant my lettuce into my beds, I'll transplant them 8 to 10 inches apart as well. It's been about a month and my Adriana lettuce plants are doing extremely well. And the key to high quality lettuce that's sweet, tender and delicious is consistent moisture. If the plants are under drought stress and the soil is very dry, they can bolt and the leaves will turn bitter. So make sure you stay on top of watering. And when you do water, be sure to water deeply so the plants set deep roots in the soil. I'm also on the lookout for lettuce pests like slugs. Look at this guy. You can see the damage from slugs. It's quite obvious. And so when I see slugs, I handpick them. And when the plants are young, I use diatomaceous earth to dissuade the slugs and prevent them from reaching the plants. Aphids are another common garden pest, often hiding more inside the plants. And if you do see them, a quick jet of water will knock most of the aphids off your plants. And don't forget to succession plant. Planting more lettuce in late summer allows you to enjoy the bounty of homegrown lettuce well into autumn. My Adriana lettuce is now ready to harvest. And I like to pick my lettuce in the morning when the leaves are full of moisture and crisp and sweet. Now lettuce is best harvested when it's immature to slightly immature, as that is when it tastes the best. And if you wait until it bolts, and that's when the plants elongate, get bigger, and start to produce flowers, you're going to find your lettuce has become quite bitter. So do harvest your lettuce when it reaches peak quality. There are several ways to harvest lettuce from your garden. First, you can just harvest a few leaves from each plant. I usually try to choose the outer leaves so the center of the plant can still develop. So you just simply remove the leaves by clipping them off at the base with your fingers or a pair of garden snips. Adriana is a butterhead lettuce, and to harvest butterhead or romaine types, you can pick the outer leaves, you can pull up the whole plant, or slice the head about an inch above the soil surface. Then fertilize with a liquid organic food, and the plant will regrow a smaller but still delicious head.